Hello everyone and welcome. What we can complain about today is the weather. Absolutely perfect playing conditions. My name is Derek Ray and joining me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And what we have coming up for you is live action from the J1. It's Nagoya Grampus and they take on San Frecce Hiroshima. Thank you, Derek. I was just flicking through my notes at this one. Everything pointing to a really lively matchup. This is fingers crossed, eh? This is how it looks for the home side. Pretty well balanced, this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4-2-3-1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4-5-1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. This is how the visitors will set up today. It does rather look as though it's going to be a battle of the 4-5-1 formations in this game. Similar setups, Lee. Well, it looks lovely in the graphic, doesn't it? There's players everywhere. They have got the freedom to roam around the pitch how they see fit. There is some structure to it, but that lone striker up front needs support, not only around him, but from wide areas of two. The supply line will come from the wide midfield players and maybe the overlapping fullbacks. And the match begins. Inagaki. Might be able to produce from this position. Well, the flag has gone up here. Offside it is. Vieira and winning it back goalkeeper should take charge Sho Inagaki Ayoyama Plenty of forward momentum here But can they produce? And that is offside Yuichi Maruyama Kazuya Miyahara Now Javier Running with the ball confidently Must take the lead here It could be up for grabs And I think the threat has been averted well, everybody in this ground, including me and you, Derek, think that's in. Goalkeeper didn't think so. And a useful cross. Nodded straight down the throat of the goalkeeper. Right behind it. The only way you can score there goes either side of the keeper. And players waiting in the centre. There to take it away. A really effective shielding under pressure. A 
Room to manoeuvre on the wing. It might be on for them. Well, pass after pass, maybe they can chisel an opportunity. Fruitful looking attack. Teammates in the middle, just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Possession changes hands, the interception there. Well, Derek, there's nothing between these two teams in terms of possession. Can someone take control of this game? Take a few more risks. Hopefully we'll see a goal soon. Gabriel Javier. Read it magnificently and intercepted. He could pick out a teammate. An attack full of promise. Terrific block there. Promising pass. And providing width. The cross is on. Well, they couldn't keep it. The first half here comes to an end. Teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Kawabe. It's with Aoyama. Hayao Kawabe. And space to cross it. Yuki Nogami. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Can they get in behind them? And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. And a substitution in the offing. Played in there. So a goal kick is what's coming up here. Oh, they've lost it. Options in the middle. Looks promising, this. And just slightly offside. Inagaki still on level terms moving the ball nicely 
Kazuya Miyahara. Not a bit of an unforced error, and it's going to be a throw. And time for the change now. Tsukasa Morishima. Ayoyama. Kawabe. He'll try his luck here. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Well, just lost his focus for a brief moment, and now it'll be a corner. Over it comes. And a throw in forthcoming. Now he must favour the cross. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw in. Tsukasa Morishima. Making progress. Kashiwa. Tremendous challenge. Gabriel Javier. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Giving it a try. This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, it looks like the game is over, but no. There's another chance, and there it is, back of the net. It looks like the winner. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. And then the composer is impressive as he smashes the ball with all he has to beat a forlorn goalkeeper. Brilliant strike. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Ayoyama, Tsukasa Morishima. Kawabe. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left, and the margin just one. Yuki Nogami, Araki. And here they come, still pressing for an equaliser. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Three minutes of added time here. Time for a change then. Hayao Kawabe. Vieira. Oh, nice ball. And there it is, the final whistle, and it's a victory for the home side. They're going to be happy with this result, Lee.
Yeah, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result. Well, as we run the rule over this man's work, positive after positively. Well, he's always a danger, isn't he? No more so when he grabbed that goal. He never disappoints me when I watch him. He's just too good, simple.